magnesium and our health. This is fascinating. I'm gonna to read to you something. I'll, I'll put a screenshot here. Um, I think that's the word. I have no idea how to do it, but I'm gonna figure it out. If not, I'll ask one of my kids, but we'll, we'll put it on the side or just pop it up here. Uh, this is from Medical News Today. This is fascinating regarding magnesium. And it say, the title is, Magnesium May Prime the Immune System to Fight Cancer and infections. And we know that magnesium is extremely important, number one. We know magnesium, number two, is something that we just don't get a lot of in our diet for a number of reasons. Number one, so many people are on diets that are restricting the foods that they eat in an effort to try to lose weight. Any diet where you limit foods that have magnesium, you're just gonna not have enough magnesium in the diet or in your body. And if you are still trying to eat those foods, it is possible that unless you're eating a lot of organic vegetables, these vegetables that you're eating are grown in soil that doesn't have a lot of these minerals. Also, the soil may not have fulvic acid, humic acid, it may not have trace minerals. And so when you're eating, let's say a broccoli or a cucumber or spinach or whatever, whatever the vegetable is, you may not be getting as many of those minerals as you really should. So here's, let me just present to you some of the summaries. And again, I'm gonna, I'm gonna screenshot this or put it up somehow. And it says magnesium deficiency has links to a wide variety of diseases. We already knew that. Researchers have now shown in mice how magnesium improves the ability of the immune system to eliminate infected and cancerous cells. Now this is big, and this is not me saying this. This is medical news today. So I'm just presenting this to you so you can read further on it if you want. But your immune system and your uh, ability to fight cancer may depend upon your magnesium status, which means the healthier you are, the more likely you're gonna survive uh, infections and cancer, right? Now it says the analysis, their analysis of data from clinical studies also suggests that low serum levels of the substance are associated with worse outcomes in treatment, in cancer treatment. And so it behooves us that if we're going to live our lives fearful of viruses, if we're gonna live our lives fearful of cancer, the best thing that we can do is become as healthy as humanly possible. And that includes having enough magnesium in your diet and in your body. Today's video sponsor is BiOptimizers and they have a great product called Magnesium Breakthrough. This has seven different types of magnesium listed right here. Cool. So what I do is I take two tablets of Magnesium Breakthrough at nighttime. It does four things for me personally. It supports healthy sleep. It supports healthy muscle and heart function. It supports healthy blood pressure and it supports healthy digestive function. Over 70% of people do not get enough magnesium in their diet because they're just not eating enough food that has enough magnesium. So there's a link down in the description down below and also there is a discount code. Make sure and use the discount code. Let them know you love me.